All right, let's do this. Hi, hello. Um, fit check, new fit for the for the for the uh, in bracket. <laughs> it's not my best work, but I, it's fine. It's serviceable. Um, to be honest, um, I'm kind of stalling here. <laughs> because I'm absolutely terrified for this week's matchup, which is um, round one of the... Well, it's actually, it's, it's not double elim, it's single elim, so it's technically winners always, but whatever. Um, gold bracket um, against KD and the, his team, the Boston Red, Sol Red Souls, which is a very good name, but uh, yeah. This is so stressful. I'm, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I'm going at this pretty stressed out. I'm not, gonna lie. <laughs> not to make it sound like it's not fun. Um, it is. I have to get the code in. Alright. We're good. I'm um, just gonna wait for his response. Nothing to worry about. Um, but seriously though, this is so stressful. <laughs> um, his team has a lot of variance in terms of big threats. Um, I think the best way to put it is his team has a lot of very big threatening high tier mons, and then a bunch of low tier mons that can kind of do whatever the hell they want, and you can't really know until it's too late. <laughs> like Riolu is a really good example, Jolteon, it's not really... Still hands not that complicated, but um, nothing can be a pain, theoretically speaking. Um, even if they decide to bring it, it's the real question here. Um, I could very well see no Jolteon, um, but I wouldn't blame them for bringing it either. Um, but yeah, they are going to be on soon. Um, let's be in searching now, it's fine. They are genuinely absolutely terrified for this week. Um, I'm prepped for not as much as I'd like going into it. Um, not to say I haven't prepped a lot, because I think I have, honestly. Um, I, you know, sometimes no matter how much you prep, you're just going to be stressed going into a match. And this is one of those times, absolutely, where I, I don't think it mattered how good of a game plan I had going into it. Um, this is always going to be stressful, so we're just going to get into it. Um, whenever that happens, you know, obviously. Right in here, not really that big a deal. Um, let me make sure everything is right. Um, I only have one mod that can Terra, just with Cryagonal. Um, most of my leads involve bring Cryagonal, but it's very likely that that won't be the case, um, depending on what they are actually bringing to the match. Um, but the vast majority of the time, with most of their high tiers, Assuming like a good chunk of the right here is actually coming to the match, um, I most likely am going to be leading Kragnol and Ali. Um, that is subject to change, obviously. Mag mortar is a big problem, um, but you know, nothing I can do about that really. Um, all right, we are getting into it. Um, I'm really curious what their team is going to be here. I'm sure there was one, is that right? I haven't actually, I, haven't, I, I don't think I've selected the rules since... I genuinely don't remember the last time I selected the rules for our match. Not that it really matters, but... This is the right team, correct? Yep, okay. So you see Choice Band and I Life, you do see Choppleberry on um, Magnezone. There's some interesting choices on this team, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but yeah, we're getting into this right now. Okay, that's actually... Almost bar for bar. <laughs> what I was expecting. No Gujar Hisui, we absolutely adore that. Gujar is like one of the biggest threats after the Eyelight, obviously. Um, the... What's it called? The Comfy is a, is, a, is a definitely a threat. Can't deny that. Um, Yastic obviously does some stuff too. I think we are just gonna be leading Eyelight. Honestly, I think it's just gonna be the set that we... Or I had decided on originally. Um, if we lose to Star After, that's really unfortunate, but... I don't know, man. I kind of just gotta go with this, I think. Bleeding Star is crazy with an Eyelight team. I don't know. That's just my thought on it. I, I, I don't know. Maybe you do anyways and just get it over with. Am I good with this lead? Am I gonna go with this? That comfy is actually pretty annoying looking at it. Um, I recognize that it was a thing going into it, but hey. 
It wasn't my biggest priority, I'm not gonna lie. Um, can run Trick Room as well, that's important to know. It doesn't really seem to be that room, Trick Room oriented, but... I uh, never know, but uh, we're gonna use this right here. Um, I think I said it already, but go like a fun to um, Katie. And yeah, Staraptor Magmortar is not a good lead for us, technically. <laughs> it is technically not a good lead, but honestly, I'm just gonna click close. Okay, so it's Reckless also is important to see. I'm gonna click Icy Wind, I think. I mean, it's definitely an argument to me that we don't click Icy Wind here, but I'm just gonna do it, I think. And we're gonna Terror as well. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm not gonna think about it too much, I think. I, I don't want that Magmortar gone, I'm not gonna lie. I'm really not in the mood to fight that Magmortar. Um, if we get burned, we get burned. That's kind of where I'm at right now. Um, theoretically speaking, I'm assuming it's an offensive Magmortar based on what they're leading here. Um, depending on what set exactly it's running, we should kill every time with CC. When they are tearing, I don't think that matters at all because they're gonna be tearing into some Tower Karate. Is that Tower Fire, maybe? Or Water, okay, that's fine. It doesn't actually change the calc or anything. It's from neutral to neutral, depending- I just hope it's not super bulky. Oh, just follow me, okay, that's fine. Um, hmm, how does that go out, actually? So yeah, we know it's speed, we know it's not scarf now. Oh my god, that did so much, actually. What, hello? I did a million. Okay, we didn't see the speed drop on the No, we did, okay. Okay, no items known yet. It's probably Code Cloak on the right corner. Okay, it goes down, nice, let's go. That's super good, actually. That's super good. Honestly, I don't even care if an alive dies right now. I don't even care. I mean, I wouldn't mind if it lived, but yeah, that's fine. Um, that's an interesting first turn. Let's see, Staraptor going to Owen, maybe? Okay. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. I accepted that a long ago. <laughs> um, luckily, we're not going for like bulk up stuff or anything. Wow, it took so much recoil there. Okay. Um, do we just go into... I think we just go really here and just click Fake Out or... Grassy Glide if we want to. What could they have in the back right now is the question. That is a serious question here. We haven't seen, um... Oh, is it not Weavile? I just realized. Um, I think I didn't even put down that it wasn't, um... Maybe it was Fram? I can't remember. I think I, I should have already done this, to be fair, but... What are we thinking here on this? I'm not sure. Do we want to Grassy Glide the Annihilate? I'm not sure. See the Terra Blast Calc on Annihilate here. Terrastal. It is over half. Do we want to. I don't think I want to deal with the Staraptor. I think we had speed it, that was the thing. Um, we are running a lot of speed on Real Room, I believe. Like, I'm going to check that make sure before I commit to it. I think I should have speed it normally, so I'm going to play Woodhammer, I think. And then we can Terra Blast the Annihilate, and we'll see what happens. Um, if it's Scarf, it's Scarf. We'll find out now. They switch out, that's fine, depending what they go into here. Ooh, that's good. That's super good, depending... We should have speed. Um... No, I'm actually crazy. Um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just capping. Um, but we don't speed the Annihilate, that's good. Look at Terra Blast here. I mean, it would be that much, really. Um, it does over half, so it's probably an offensively oriented one, it looks like. Is that weakness policy? It is weak. That's terrifying. Okay. I'll be completely honest, I don't think that changes any calcs. I think it probably killed, likely, either way. Whatever comes out, we actually have speed it guaranteed. That's good. Did nothing, actually. Okay, that's Rocky Helmet Max Defense, is what that is. Um, just for bulk up. We actually don't hate that. They can't click Tailwind here, but we should be able to outspeed it and Oko. Um, if we click, um, Icy Wind probably doesn't kill. Realistically, but we could try it maybe. Dude, not right now. My phone just went off and it's like literally, dude, any other time. I think we click um, Grassy Glide into the comfy slot. We could also just Woodhammer um, if we don't think they're gonna be. I'm fine with this. I'm fine with this turn here. Yeah, I mean, seriously. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. They could definitely still win this. I'm not trying to count them out yet or anything. I'm just. I'm, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just. I'm just scared, man. I don't know. <laughs> Um, definitely got some momentum there, but they definitely took some back with that one. I mean, we knock them down below half again, but they probably killed Rage Fist. I don't think it's down. We know we have Speed the Annihilate, so if the Rebel Boom isn't attacked here, we probably just get a kill on the Annihilate. Uh, not necessarily a kill, but we've got some chip. <laughs> Let's see what it's going for here. Is it just going for the... is it just going for Dragon Line? Makes sense. 
I'm actually already dehydrated. Um, obviously, we can one that's not even brushing, really. Hmm. It was kind of awkward to see. Eh, maybe not no fake out on this team, but it could be fake out less. Not much fake out. <laughs> I'm losing it, but. So no Greninja here. Should I always let speed the Nally? I don't think we actually kill it either. This is interesting because we. Pretty sure it's not Scarf, so we should be able to just take it out here. I mean, I can check the Calyx here. Dragon was doing over half with Terrasal Terra Blast, so that means Greninja probably does at least a good chunk here. Uh, I don't know if I want to rely on that. I'm gonna go for this to this, and we're gonna for Water Pledge into this slot. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. That's fine. For Water Pledge, obviously we're Protean, so we're gonna change. I don't think that really changes any Calyx, but maybe it will. Um, I would assume the weakest policy in Eilid will still kill, either way. <laughs> and we go for Woodhammer, we'll see if this kills, I'm not so sure it will, but... It does just take it out, nice, that is awesome, we love to see that. Um, wasn't a fan of how much we had to reveal game one, but honestly, it was kind of chill. Um, that was a great, that was great, hell yeah. Yes, yes please, more of that. Um, and I like just taking out the Magmortar was awesome, because that thing is a monster. And I don't want to deal with it at all, so... Um, can we... That was such a bad voice crack, what the hell was that? I don't know what that was, but it's pretty funny. Um, based on that last team, how does Cinderace do here? Um, it outspeeds the... Star Raptor, which is nice. Does it outspeed the Star Raptor? That's kind of all it does. Um... Yeah, because it doesn't really do much to... Nihilate... It doesn't really do much to Meowstic, necessarily. Or not Meowstic, Comfy, sorry. Um... Actually, no, we can gunk shot the comfy. Oh, hold on. They, 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 they brought the Weavile. They didn't bring the Annihilate, or the Primarina. That's what I messed up here. But they brought the Weavile, which is annoying, but I kind of prefer they bring the Weavile to anything else. So I think this time around we could maybe try something with Nita Zone. I could maybe see that working, but it might be a little risky with... Um, Magmortar to be able to be on the field. Um, we can actually double the Magmortar with um, Real Boom Greninja. Although it is considering that we don't outspeed it. Yeah. So I might want to do Cryogonal. Eh, I might just leave the same thing, actually. I might literally do the same exact thing. I genuinely feel more confident against certain other leads that they could go for here with um, my first lead. <laughs> if they adapt properly and they take me out with that, Fair enough, I understand that, but, um, I might drop the Greninja and, mmm, going Gunshot kind of goes crazy, I'm not going to lie. It kind of does actually hit everything on the field. I'm going to go for it. It's maybe not the best, because we can, might lose to the Annihilate, but it's fine. Because Gunshot, we get that, um... Fighting resist, which I'm not necessarily going to go for with an Eye because they just go Rage Fist every time, because that move's ridiculous, but... I don't know, man. Well, I guess we'll see, pretty much. I guess we'll see. What's the lead here? Meowstic, Star Raptor. That's not great, I'm not going to lie. But we are double cloak, so they basically can't ever beat us there. I'm not sure the Star Raptor lives, even with them. Um, even assuming obvious counts. Grab Star Raptor. I don't think it's it's not Scar. Um, we're assuming it's probably not bulky. Oh my god! I opened the freaking debug menu by mistake. You're kidding me. Um, close combat just kills. So I'm gonna click close combat and announce the Earth that slot, and then we're gonna just get an icy wind. And we're gonna see what happens. I don't know. I mean, you have a two wave. That makes sense. I actually don't really. I don't hate that. Um, we probably just die here with um, an ally. It's fine. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Um, that's that's good info though, I'm not gonna lie. Um, it's probably not screens then. I mean, it totally could be screens still. So I'm assuming it's not fake out at the very least. Um, let's see if for now it is still screens. Just cause... That's just unfortunate. I don't even know what else to say there. That's just really, wow, that's crazy. That's crazy crazy. That's like, what on earth just happened actually? What on earth was that, dude? That was nuts. Um, sorry. That was kind of messed up. I'm not gonna lie. Um, do we freeze dry or something? I think we do. 
If they're gonna set reflect, they're gonna set reflect, right? Like, fair enough. Totally a thing they could do. Um, yeah. Um, do we wanna... Mm, I'm just gonna whatever. I don't, I don't even care really. I mean, it's probably not the right play, but whatever. I'm just gonna double the Annihilate. I actually don't really care about the Mastic, funnily enough. If they set Reflect, they set Reflect. Um, its damage compared to Annihilate isn't really that high. The cool thing is, Annihilate does have to set up a bit first. Um, assuming they love this turn because they're gonna bulk up right now, and maybe even Reflect. Um, I am, I'm gonna assume they love this turn. They're gonna be pretty puffed up. But... So nice might be able to come in the back and take it out. Just barely. Gotta go protect. Alright, fair enough. Yeah, that's fair. I kinda got fit there. <laughs> yeah, you should reflect. Alright, that's not great. Um, kinda wish I see one did now, but okay. Fair enough. Um, do we want to... Um, Terra this turn? I'm not sure. Not sure if I want to Terra or not. Eh. Still kinda mid about it. I'm gonna Woodhammer the Meowstic slot. We can even Grass Glide. I want to see the Calc for Max... I'm um, not max HP or anything. Um, you know, stick. Let's assume it's genuinely like no bulk. Woodhammer should kill then. That's interesting. Um, they just set reflect, so that's my bad. Um, letting them get that off. I may just terrible off it even, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. This is just very likely not a great play, but I'm just gonna go for it. Um, I'm not trying to be unconfident, but I'm not liking the odds of the second game working out for me. I think the light screen makes sense. Not really that's where I think for half. Hopefully should be kind of busy out here. I don't need to kill a little bit. Yeah, just half. Right, not as much as I was hoping, obviously. Uh, very much good we do call that turn correctly, which is nice. Um Star Wars comes out, I don't think we'll kill. No, we're not very offensive. Actually, we are very offensive to that thing while we're killing this way. It does not go down, which is fine. Fine. <laughs> it's okay. I guess. Uh, I think we click this, and then we click protect, or we just go into... No, we can click protect. I'm down to click protect here, yeah, that's fine. We could even just woodhammer this thing and then click protect. I think I want to do that, actually. <laughs> is that crazy? Kind of crazy, actually, yeah. I'm gonna go for it. Yeah, this is kind of dumb, but I'm gonna go for it. Alright. What do we got? Do we get attacking move now? Okay. Um, wow, that's crazy. Alright, cool. That's, that's pretty lucky, I'm not gonna lie. I did a lot, actually. I'm really surprised how much I did, actually. Um, they're going for bulk up now, which is not great. I'm not gonna lie, it's not, not the best here. Um, now, funnily enough, I think we just double into the Annihilate right now. Um, which is what they want me to do. <laughs> um, do we click? No, I think we would hammer this and then... Oh, but I really don't want to get paired with... This sucks. This turn sucks, I'll be honest. This is not a great turn. Um, did you go for find a way to finally burn out? Which will probably just kill the drill boom? I can't deny. That's kind of bulky. I don't know. Which just comes out with okay, guts. That's fair. Um, I'll be completely honest, I don't mind just getting chip here. Because we can just protect on the Cinderace turn. Because we kind of want to take out the Annihilate before they let the Comfy in or something. So let's see how much that does. I, another one will kill, it looks like, but I'm not sure how much that will matter in the grand scheme of things. Because they can just protect this turn and then get a bunch of healing off. Which will let Comfy get in and then they can click Floral Healing and then it's Joe over. Okay, um... What do we do here? How do we, how do we play this? I wish I had Ninja in the back, funnily enough. Um, which is kind of my bad, but I don't know. I don't know what I want to click here because Protect will be interesting because we get to and deny a Rage Fist, but they can just click like Drain Punch or whatever. Have they even used the Fighting Move yet? I don't think they have. No, they used Drain Punch. They used Drain Punch. Yeah, yeah, they did. Okay. Um, I 
I think I'm gonna do wood hammer here and I'm gonna protect with the sun race. So I really don't want to get paired. That is like the last thing I want to happen, which is why I probably shouldn't. No, I'm just gonna protect. It's fine. I'm just gonna protect. It's okay. They switch. So if we get a kill here. No, but they probably just kill me. It's comfy. Okay, of course it is. Um, that makes sense. I'm not that surprised to see that. Um, just for the level, that's holy. Just attacking this under assault like a crazy person. Just do it. <laughs> it's not even like smart. It's not even smart to attack in that slot. Okay, they have to protect. That, that makes so much more sense. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. I'd prefer to just be in the wrong, kind of. <laughs> um, I don't think Cinderace ever kills here. I'd love to see it, but I don't think it does. Um, especially at plus one. And Oh yeah, it's gonna heal too. Oh, Reflect wears off, which is nice. Um, aggressive terrain goes away as well. Not great. What do we do here? What happens here? I don't know. Because I think Woodhammer will kill, but I don't think know if that matters or not. Um, I, I might just want to gunk shot into this slot. I might just want to double the annihilate because I just protected even. That's actually true. I think I want to do that, yeah. Okay, we're doing that. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going. That makes sense. Ah, whatever. And I just gotta take that in stride. Um, the comfy is really annoying, yeah. I'm not gonna lie here. Go both and go. There's nothing. We gotta get this crit with. Oh, yeah, it's just okay. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. What a weird spot to be in right now because I can maybe see what the comfy's gonna go for next time or something. I don't know. I can go for the crit. We can hope for the crit. I mean, that's possible. I'm not even sure if it would kill, but it might be closer. <laughs> I mean, it is floor healing every time, actually, now I'm thinking about it. Um, we obviously don't real gunk shot here, but whatever. Okay, um, how do we bring this back here? I'm not sure exactly. So they don't know I'm gunk shot on anything, so that's cool. We're also... Choppleberry... on the... Magnezone, which is really important actually, I'm thinking about it. That's actually huge. Um, because they can't two a us, they can't kill us with close combat on the Star Apple. Um, there's a lot of things for that, but... Do we like Kragonal and... What's it called? Uh, Magnezone? Is that the lead? I'm not sure. Um... Greninja's not awful either. Ooh, Greninja actually goes hard now I'm thinking about it. Greninja in the back, I think, is the better option here because we can counter the Annihilate. I don't know necessarily if that'll kill, but it'll be close. I'll have to check the Galax on that. Actually, yeah, definitely will. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, game three. This was expected. Um, I want to use Greninja. I want to try to get a counter off. I'm not sure if it'll work. <laughs> Let's just say that. I'm not sure if it'll work, but we'll try. Um, how do we beat the same lead there? I'm not sure exactly. Do we do this? Roll is kind of important, but I also don't mind being wrong there. Um, we lead Weavile and I like, it's kind of awkward, but not too awkward. Because we can double the Annihilate and stuff like that. And we can just buy Breast of the Weavile turn one even. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. Do I want to lead an Eyelip? I kind of do. I kind of want to lead an Eyelip. I'm not going to lie. No, I'm not going to, even though I really want to. Um, Rillaboom's interesting too. I think it loses too hard to both my Border and Staraptor. And Rio Ninja doesn't really do much against the Comfy. But it's fine. Okay, so this. If this doesn't work, it doesn't work. I mean, I'm fine with it. Um. <laughs> I'd be very interested to see the counter work, but I totally understand if it doesn't. Um, by that I mean I have counter on Greninja Focus Sash, so who knows how that's gonna go. <laughs> As extra after late again, they were making similar lead for me, which is understandable. Um, we just click table to the Star After slot because I feel like it's gonna be like CC or something like that. Do we see it switch moves ever? I don't think we did. As soon as we saw Brave Bird, and then that's it. Pretty much. I can't think of any other moves that I ever went for, so... I feel like I can say pretty definitively that it's not going to be clicking anything else. Do you play Iron Defense here? I don't think that matters. Um, we can try it. I'm kind of down to try it, honestly. 
Yeah, whatever. Let's just try it. They click close combat, and then they paralyze me, and then I um, hopefully get away with murder and don't get paralyzed. <laughs> okay. Um. Well, here we here we go. Let's go gambling. Brave bird that just just takes us down. Sure, that's fine. We click iron defense, which is certainly a move. <laughs> Um, we should outspeed the Star After Guaranteed with Greninja. I just don't think know if it'll kill or not. That's the problem. I'm just really unsure if it'll kill. So I don't think it's bulky Star After at this point. I, I really don't. If it has bulk, it's like very minimal. I do think it might be the call to go to Greninja here, even though it's kind of awkward. I don't think it kills, but we can try it, honestly. Ooh, with Icy Wind, we actually might kill with Greninja. That's interesting. Which... <sighs> that sucks too, though. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I might just click Dark Pulse and see what happens. Kind of, I don't know. It's fine. We can even just click Dark Pulse into the Meowstic slot and then go for a T Bolt with Staraptor. That's fine, actually. Yeah, I'm chill with that. Actually, yeah, that's fine. They switch out. Nice. That's that's good. Depending on what they go into here. Okay, that's 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 fine. Kind of. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna do much here, but we might do some chip. I don't know. You have a light screen. That makes sense. Um, I don't know how this is gonna go. We're probably just gonna click um, counter. <laughs> this is too schizo. I don't know if I can click counter, dude. I don't know if it's possible. Ooh, that is an insanely good para, which actually might be bad for us. Now that I'm thinking about it. Am I insane to click counter here? I think I am. I think I am actually crazy to click counter here because... Ah, frick, dude, you're kidding me. This is not okay. Do we click Dark Pulse into the, into the slot? I feel like we might even be a right call. Because we can just start targeting this thing and then not care anymore. This is dumb. This is dumb, but I'm going to do it anyway, so let's do it. Reflect comes up, that's fine. No physical wands here. Well, there is a physical wand, but it's not normally. This this part of the matchup is not gonna be clicking physical moves. Um let's get a flinch, how about? Let's get a flinch here. Let's see it. Let's go! Let's go, dude. I know that's really cheesy, but I honestly I don't care. I'm gonna be real here. I actually don't care at all. Um I think we Dark Pulse this thing and then T bolt the Annihilate. They switch out, that's fine. Um, well, maybe not. Maybe it's comfy, so. It is comfy, yeah, that makes sense. Let's see if the T-Bolt kills, how about? Let's say that. Let's see if T-Bolt kills here. <laughs> okay, yeah. Nay, nah, you're right. That's my bad. <laughs> Hopefully, they see the threat that Greninja is here. Um, that is zero. Never mind, they're not gonna think that at all. Um, they're gonna think the Nine Zone is a threat, obviously. Um, I think we just keep attacking. Nah, eh, we don't want to switch with Greninja here. What an interesting little section we're at here, because I can click Shadow Claw and hopefully get a crit. And if they fighting move the Greninja, then we get a free turn, basically. So I'm going to flash cannon the Comfy here. Well, we have the light screens up, but it should do a bit. This is so scary, dude. I'm like terrified. Why would they click Rage Fist into the Greninja Assault? That doesn't make any sense for any reason. Like seriously, that doesn't make any sense. It doesn't. I know it's been, I know it's been hit like three times, but even then you should click Dream Punch with right. Just half, like less than. I got hurt again, that's crazy, dude, what? That's really unlucky, I'm sorry. I'm gonna click Shadow Claw like every time here, and then we're gonna kill the Comfy, hopefully. Um, yeah, I don't even know what to say anymore. I'm like losing my mind here. This is so cheesy, but I mean, uh, that's just how it be. Um, keep in mind, we have not won this yet. Don't. No, 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 no. We have not won this yet. At all. Ugh. You're kidding me, dude. This is not okay. What does the comfy even do? Training Kiss probably doesn't do much to an ally here, honestly. It really doesn't. I don't think it does. Unless it comes back in and makes sense. Fair enough. Um, I think we just go for the. They double switch Andrew Storm, okay, okay. So are they fake out then? It makes me think they're fake out. I'm not sure if that's the case or not. Okay, they called that Shadow Claw really well. Or 
I don't know if they're called Shadow Claw specifically, but that was a really good call on their part. Um, Draft Kitten comes out. I think he's doing not enough to kill, which is fine. Um, we can Shadow Claw the this thing, and then... Or do we want to switch back to Greninja? I think we do want to switch back to Greninja, actually. Um, I think that's the play here, yeah. I think, actually. Because if we take out the Meowstic and the Comfy, they can't really do anything at this point. I think we just T-bolt the Seraptor. Yeah, I think that's fine. They switch. Okay, that's interesting. Um, who is that switching to? Then? Nah, so that's taking a Shadow Claw if I get this. Oh, wait, nice. No, did I switch? I switched, I think. Yeah, 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 that's my bad. No, 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 I'm, I'm just being foolish. <laughs> I obviously switched because I didn't want an app to get Oko'd. <laughs> so no counter for me, most likely, depending what they go for here, obviously, but did he go for River? That's fine. I'm not like super happy about that, but we kind of just gotta take what we can get here. Um, I think it should bring the Staraptor into range. If they're quick attack, they're quick attack. Like, fair enough. Let's see what we only attack with. Okay, my bad. <laughs> the Magnus Zone is just kind of chilling here, being a big threat. I'm not gonna lie. Um, what do you teams reflect for is off? They go into Meowstic probably anyways, which is fine. Comfy, I mean, obviously. Fair enough. Um, the Comfy is in a weird spot where we can kind of kill it with multiple ones here. We can Dark Pulse the Annihilate again and just kind of chip away at it some more. I'm just going to Flash Cannon again, and we're just going to see how much it does, because I don't even know anymore. Um, we're in a really weird spot where... Yeah, that makes sense. That's, that's fine. It's not good, obviously, but it, it, it's fine, quote-unquote. Like, whatever. Dark Pulse comes out here. Turn to Dark Tower. Right, technically, whatever. That is a lot, actually. That is a lot, actually. Oh, yeah. Um, so they're probably just gonna kill the Greninja, question mark? If they even get to move, to be fair. Um... Okay, oh yeah, 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 fair enough. Yep, 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 okay. Alright, okay, okay, I'm so scared. They're gonna pair the- oh no. <laughs> they're gonna pair the- they die late, oh no. Oh, if they bring, if they come back from this, they earned it really hard because they got so unlucky. Katie got so unlucky the whole time. So if they come back from this, they they got it. Like fair enough. The question is, do they have enough speed investment, and do I get unlucky here? Which I mean, would be not really that unlucky because we're getting lucky the whole time. They go for thunder wave. Yep, that makes sense. Um, are we faster? And are they? Are we paired? Flash game comes out, we're faster than anything, which is kind of funny, but yeah. I might just come down to the annihilate, just killing everybody. Um, it's faster! Oh god, it's over. <laughs> we lost. Okay, oh, that's fun. I think we lost, yeah. Um, I mean, we can still try here. How fast is this thing then? What the hell? Is it max speed? I guess it is. Which means it's not as bulky as I thought it would be. Which is interesting to say the least. We do like a third of this, so if they get lucky with some paras. Assuming we're plus two, assuming they are. Assuming they're just max attack, max speed, because that's pretty much what they have to be to actually get away with hitting me. Rage Fist is boosted like all the way at this point, let's assume. It does like over half, it looks like. So I'm gonna click T Bolt and we're gonna see what happens here pretty much. Um, we should live one. Oh! I'm sorry, that's so cheesy. I'm so sorry about that, but I think there's pretty good odds that Magnuson lives one anyways, so it would come down to a crit most likely. Oh my god, that was so stressful. Oh my god, that was so stressful. <laughs> that was so, I felt so bad about that. We actually won because of paralysis, like literally. <laughs> like Jesus Christ. That is that is like the most me win ever, I think. <laughs> that is like how the most me win ever, I think. I am so sorry. I genuinely feel awful about that. But also I feel good because it's still a win, even if it was through RNG. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know, like, uh, uh, fair enough. I just, yeah. I'm so happy Magnezone is cracked. I'm so happy it is. I genuinely, this thing is such a monster. 
even against the matchups that are like just okay for it, it still does crazy. Because we had Choppleberry, dude. Like, I swear we lived that. I'm assuming, right here, I'm assuming Max Attack, Adamant, um, and I have no boosts up yet, but still. I'm assuming six boosts on Rage Fest. It does over half, but it only does 70%, so it had to get a crit. Which obviously kills with a crit, but yeah. So genuinely, obviously, all the other paras made the game state better for me, but that very last para was only so impactful when it really comes down to it. That's assuming it was max rage fists, which I'm not so sure it was. Um, but either way. <laughs> I'll just say, I'll just say GG right here. That's what I'll say. Um, really sorry to not Katie out there from, from mostly from RNG. <laughs> um, but I'm really excited to be moving on. I want to make a difference here. I want to want to go far in this bracket is what I'm trying to say. Um, I'm going to leave a link to the... If I remember, I'll leave a link to the team in the description because I'm, I I like some of the sets here. Um, but yeah. Sorry, I'm not that talkative at the end here. I'm kind of just like in shock. Ooh, a little bit sore subject. Maybe shock's not the right word there. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, but I think that's going to be it for now. Um, GG's to Katie once again. I mean, I guess that's why we say good luck, have fun, right? <laughs> that's a little toxic, I'm not going to lie. Sorry about that. But uh, have a nice day, everybody, and uh, goodbye.